Let me show you a quick proof of a reflection principle. Reflection principle is pretty much showing um, the symmetry of of uh, uh, the Brownian motion and then uh, define mt as a uh, m as maximum of of b uh, bs. So pretty much the entire process of Brownian motion with the maximum value. Uh, uh, within that within that period, and tau t is pretty much the first time the 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 Brownian motion reached to value a. And when this is the result of. Uh, of a reflection a principle, the theorem. Uh, it's pretty much the maximum of the Brownian motion greater than A, the probability of that is twice as much of a Brownian motion at time T uh, greater than A. So to prove it, we can we can translate from the left side this term to pretty much we reach to uh, we reach to t reach the maximum less than the less than the time t and for this it can be divided into two scenarios one scenario is bt greater than a another scenario is bt less than a so those two scenarios can be can be represented here so it's one greater than a, one less than a. Those two things should be should be symmetric, as you would imagine after after tau a. So we end up having this, b greater than two b greater than a tau a less than less than t. Since since the uh, since the p p greater uh, b greater than a, then this does not matter to us anymore because we already know that uh, that we'll reach some some value will at the very end of the t will reach a value greater than a then this is already started already this condition already satisfies therefore we have this so we have the proof of reflection principle